Mr President, it's hard to hurt someone when you know the story. This is the basis for the vision, purpose and projects of Big Heart and the work of the former Tasmanian Australian of the Year, Scott Rankin, as co-founder, CEO and creative director of Big Heart. Big Heart is an Australian arts and social justice company and has been part of the North West Tasmanian landscape since it was founded in 1992. It is a key driver of innovation and community development in our region, finding new ways of dealing with disadvantage. Motivated by the closure of the Burnie Paper Mill, Big Heart began working with the community, creating high quality art to transmit their story. Big Heart has initiated several large scale, long term community and cultural development projects in over 50 communities, um, particularly disadvantaged communities in urban, regional and remote Australia. Projects are task focused and are designed to increase social, cultural and economic participation for community members. It has had many successes and delivered many award winning programs in the North West for over 30 years. For example, the current Young Australian Young Tasmanian Australian of the Year, Caitlin Johnson, came through Big Heart programs on the coast. Those were the um, reconciliation dinner uh, breakfast, would have heard her speak. In December 2021, the Waratah Winyu Council announced a, announced a partnership with Big Heart to run the watershed program for the new Winyard multi-purpose building that has been built on the banks of beautiful Inglis River. This impressive new building is soon to be open to the public and will be home to the Winyard Yacht Club and Big Heart. The watershed is described as a space for community discovery and creativity. The Volunteer Marine Rescue and the Canoe Club will also be sharing this wonderful new facility. It will be a community and cultural centre offering a range of pathways and possibilities, particularly for young people. Importantly, there is a First Nations focus. The opening weekend includes a First Nations awakening of the space, First Nations music, performance and cultural exchange between the Tomagina country, the Pilbara, um, Nugal, Nugalama and the Yuan nations. Watershed's opening weekend will be this weekend, the 24th to 26th of June. Across the weekend, Big Heart will be showcasing food and produce, film, art, live music, science and environment through a series of workshops and events, as well as a seasonal winter feast. One of the activities planned for the weekend includes STEM workshops, mapping places and spaces, focusing on encouraging girls to explore skills and careers in STEM. Participants will learn about spatial mapping and get their hands on some exciting new technologies. There's always been, so there will always be, also be a seaweed foraging workshop where we can, you can learn to identify and cook different edible seaweeds, two lino printmaking workshops hosted by a local artist, and a painting workshop using natural pigments made using earth and soils. There will also be live performance when water falls and a screening of two stunning short documentary films from Tasmania's Ruman Productions. Food trucks and pop-up coffee stalls will help patrons warm up and fuel up while enjoying waterfront views and entertainment. Mr President, into the future it is anticipated the Watershed Program will deliver education, training and events in the new building and partner with local cafe chefs, businesses and community organisations to cater for a program of special events. The Watershed is an exciting opportunity for vulnerable young people of the municipality to develop confidence and new skills and open up new education and training and event opportunities for the community in partnership with rather than competing with the local hospitality industry. So Mr President, you may ask why the name Watershed. Right now it is a watershed moment for young people. Anxiety about the environment, about home ownership, about mental health and feelings of isolation can conspire to constrict young people from feeling they can achieve their full potential. Watershed is a whole of community approach to shining a light on inspirational pathways of doing, not telling. The space will provide opportunities in, in STEM and STEAM training, digital literacy, employment, democracy, culture and environment, as well as entertainment. Watershed seeks to build inclusion and community resilience, inviting people of all ages into this combined space, running all year round, encouraging intergenerational connections and civic participation. Mr President, I note and thank the many financial donors of Watershed, including the Tasmanian Government, who have committed $250,000 for one year. It will lead ongoing funding, of course. I'll be back. Yeah. Big Heart achieves outcomes across multiple government policies, mental health, justice, education, culture, employment, disability. It represents ex exceptional value for money. Therefore, the funding model needs to be um, continued in a de way across portfolios. Mr President, this is a wonderful opportunity for the community to come together 
and collaborate in a fantastic new space that will benefit our youth and our surrounding businesses. I look very much forward to dropping in on some of the activities that they hold there.